We begin tonight in Lombok, where some residents say they are worried about the city's historic trees and the hazards the trees are creating. KSBY News reporter Jacob Dizon talked to locals about the issue and what the city is doing to address them. These towering trees in South Lompoc carry a big significance to the community. But as they continue aging, some locals have raised concerns as the branches continue crashing down. Random things still happen and a huge branch fell down, down the way. And my kids were like, oh my gosh, good thing we weren't. <laughs> you know, walking at that time. Friday morning, the city of Lompoc's urban forestry division climbed into the branches of that tree on South H Street, sawing off unstable branches and clearing away the mess left behind. There might be some concerns, but I think that the city addresses that because I've lived here for 12 years now and I've observed that the city is pretty, pretty much very good about maintaining the trees. They cut off the, the dead branches and that uh, I've noticed that every year they do some kind of maintenance and they trim them as you can see. That big one right here at the corner, it seems to have little problems because it's the biggest tree of all. Yesterday, like the city had to come cut down some branches because it was hanging. Some locals saying the benefits of those long standing pines outweigh the potential hazards that come with them. It lends a lot of character to the city and they provide a lot of shade and it makes the, the whole place look, look peaceful. I don't like to park on the street because there's giant pine cones that fall and a lot of sap that drips off of the pines. Um, but I think that they're beautiful and I have noticed that some of the sidewalks and the road gets messed up from the roots, but I don't have an issue with them. The Urban Forestry Division maintains nearly 18,000 trees across city streets and local parks. They also allow for neighbors to request new trees be planted by their homes, but other locals are encouraging more attention to the ones that are aging out. I'm not an arborist, but I mean, the trees are very large, very old, and very heavy. You don't want anyone getting hurt and having a tree fall on top of their head. I reached out to Lompoc's Urban Forestry Division, but they were unavailable to comment on possible updates to their tree maintenance services. In Lompoc, Jacob Dizon, KSBY News. Lompoc neighbors who see any fallen or unstable trees are asked to call the city of Lompoc's Urban Forestry Division. That number is 805-305-8034.